I'm invisible. No, I'm not. I'm invisible. All right, guys. Hello and welcome. So we are playing another game of League of Legends. We're going to be using my best Yi build that I think I have found so far, which is uh, Blade of the Rune King into Death Dance into Mythic Item. Or sometimes you don't even really need a Mythic Item. I guess it just really depends on... Oh, we missed that one. I guess it really depends on what you want. Oh, Atrox going hard here. Mm. But, um, so the idea is that the death dance will save us because it's a broken... Man, I gotta go top. It's a broken item. It's really powerful. And honestly, like, whenever I think about champions builds that I don't want to see them build, it's always death dance, right? So I'm starting to think, like, why don't I just build death dance in if I hate seeing other people build it? Right? I hate seeing other people build it. So why don't I build it? Man, look at this set. He is so aggressive, dude. <laughs> what? All right, I'll back off this wave, Atrox. Don't worry about it, bro. Don't worry about it. Because, you know, champions like Set will build the Death Stance, right? And it's just really hard to kill them. Same for Wukong. If we buy it, we're hard to kill. We become really obnoxious. People become angry at us, right? And I think at the end of the day, that is the best mindset to have. Now, Blade of Ring King as a rush item, I'm finding isn't as good as I thought it was. Um, oh, he got my blue. But I think it is a solid option that leaves you open to a, a mythic change if you need it. So, for example, if you're not sure if the enemy is going to be too tanky, you could be like, oh, yeah, I might want to get a Kraken, right? Or maybe I want to get a dust blade. Oh, you are. No, 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 bro. Hmm, hmm. That was a rough one. Um. Anyway, so we're gonna do what? What in the world's going on top? He's into more than I am. And also, the Blade of Ring King has a really good build pass with this Reeker bow, which is a very fantastic item. Bot lane's doing really well. Um, so I really like it as a rushing item. Now, Kraken isn't too bad, and Kraken can give you a lot of damage for tanks, or he can let you solo Baron, or other good things like that. But honestly, I'm kind of falling out of love with Kraken. Because so much of Yi's kit right now is based on on-hit damage, right? And Kraken just doesn't bring that to the table, unfortunately. I mean, if Kraken worked on Alpha Strike, that would be amazing. Yeah, um, also, let me explain what I was trying to do there with that Wukong. So I knew that Wukong took my blue buff, and I kind of wanted to get some revenge. 16 CS. He took this. He did not take his Krugs. However, if we jump the Krugs, we might accidentally run into his team. Is an eternal student. I'm feeling kind of ballsy, guys. Let's do it. Let's do it. A little bit of ballsiness here. Uh, and we want to kill these small ones if we, if we got time for it. Because actually, they made it so that the small Krugs are worth more to force people to stay here and torture themselves to kill the Krugs. Thank you, thank you, Riot. Thank you. Yeah, you see how much gold these things give? The, the medium-sized ones give seven. Yeah, I'm down. I'm down. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Sneaky, sneaky. sneaky. All right. Sorry, Vane. That's my kill, baby. That's my kill. So we're going to keep working towards this. Honestly, the hardest part is the crack or of the Blade and Marine King is that pickaxe, right? Uh, at least there's no BF sword in the combination. So I'm here anyway. I'm going to go ahead and grab this dragon. Let's alpha strike dodge it a little bit. You know what's great? When I was trying to play another champion that wasn't Master Yi, I realized how good Master Yi actually is at taking dragons. Like, so many champions actually die to dragons. But Master Yi can kill a dragon at any point in the game. Yeah, that was, that was a little bit closer than I had wanted it. I Okay, you know, I don't know. This... This dragon's a little hard. Okay, assuming you're full HP, at any point in the game, you can take the dragon. Obviously, if I wasn't full HP there, I probably would have died if uh, I was using no item. But, yeah, that's something that I never really appreciate when I play other junglers because I literally only play Master Yi, you know? All right, let's clear this Gromp here and move up to the wolves and continue going. So, recently, Master Yi's gotten some hotfix nerfs that made him quite bad. And uh, I haven't really gotten to play on the hotfix nerfs too much, but I imagine that they will be giving us some compensation buffs at some point. Though, you know, if uh, you guys have any suggestions or thoughts of what those buffs should be, leave them down in the comments below, right? 
But um, I'm expecting that we'll probably have either some E damage returned. We'll definitely get the health back early. I'm sure of that one because the health is really important even in higher elo, right? But I think that maybe um, the cooldown nerf should be uh, one of the final nerfs. Because I think that having a low cooldown makes ganks more spammable for low elo, right? And if we increase the cooldown, then... Oh, my God. Don't hit this. Don't hit this. Don't... No. No. Okay. This is fine. He had to back off. But now they know I have it pinked, and that's no good. But, yeah, I think the cooldown nerf was probably the fairest of the nerfs. Oh, he just completely missed that, huh? All right. Aatrox is popping. Aatrox is popping. Mmm... Let's go down over here. We're just going to do a sweep through the jungle. Check him for wards. Check him for wolves. Hey, there's a wolf. All right. I mean, I'm here anyway, right? I don't want to go to my Krugs because you know how, like, tedious those Krugs are. Um, yeah, so that's how I feel about that. I don't think we're going to get any uh, on-hit reverts. I think they're probably going to keep it at, like, 75%. Man, I just really want to see our E buffed again. I want to see it back. I want to see it back. All right, so we're going to grab this. Yo, I could possibly dive this guy. Uh, we got five seconds on this. Okay, that guy is not worth any money. And I got some plates. We go kill this top Krug, and we're going to be really close to Blade and Ranking. We need 400 gold. Ooh, I'm not going to have enough. Hmm. Maybe I'll have to like kill Rift or something to buy some time. I usually don't like the back unless I can full buy if I'm this close. Mm. All right, let's grab this. And I'm going to be looking at what kind of options I can do to increase my gold income here. I need some gold, please. Uh, maybe I'll get the Rift Herald. Mm. Is this risky, guys? If I die too much, it's not going to be a good YouTube video. People don't like it when I die. Okay, okay, okay. We have confidence. Okay, mid just went me. Yeah. Okay, mid is heading this way. Okay. Uh... <laughs> that was my plan all along. I promise. All right, I got my gold for the blade of ranking. That's exactly what I needed. All right, so we're gonna go back by the blade of ranking, and then as I mentioned, my next set. I, you better get him. You better get him. Make him pay for that. Make him pay. He's worth money again. That 140 gold set, no more. Sit down. Quick back. That was a quick back, guys. I needed it back anyway. That's also a part of my plan. Anyway, what was I saying? Yes. After we finished the Blade of the Rune King. It's my mic. It's my, my phone. Sorry, guys. I know I, there's a lot of chest hair going on here, okay? After I finish Blade of the Rune King, we're going to get Death Dance. And the idea behind the Death Dance... How does he keep getting my blue buff? Do I even want to know? Like, okay, whatever. After my Blade of the Rune King, we get the Death Dance. And the Death Dance makes it impossible for me to die, right? Well, not necessarily impossible, but it's a frustrating amount of time to die. And honestly, I feel like if you get Death Dance on Yi, you're basically cheating. So if you want to cheat at the game, make everybody really angry and continue to win games, then definitely I think Death Dance is the way to go. So we're going to grab the Grump, and then we're going to go straight into the Dragon, continue to farm this Dragon lead while we have it. I do love Shelly more than Dragon, but honestly, like, you know, the stars didn't align to have me up towards Shelly. Hmm. Ooh, he might be able to turn it. He might be able to turn it. Wow, okay. Okay, hang on. I, I, hang on. I'm, I'm going to watch it. I'm going to watch it so we can see it all. All the BM coming in hot. All right. All right, there it goes. I'm going to get this dragon. Um, Wait, I don't know where bot is, but that's okay, actually, because when we alpha strike the dragon, it didn't move, which meant that there was no bot behind it, which is fantastic. So let's go up here, grab the blast plant, and start looking at getting towards that death stand. So we're just going to do another clear here before making our way towards bot lane. Mm -mm -mm. Keeping our eye out. We got to be careful for Twitch. He is level 6, poor guy. But he could be in biz anywhere. 
I'm gonna ping him a few times. You never know where he's at. He could be looking to wreak havoc in mid. There he is. He's back in bot lane. Okay, I was a little bit scared about that. You gotta keep your eyes open for the Twitch because those guys are the ones that can really sneak up on you. <laughs> Get it? Okay, anyway. So Krugs, and then we're gonna pivot into a gank in top lane. We have no camps left, right? So we gotta find something to do before we go over to this... Uh, before we go for the reclear. Actually, I kind of want to get red buff. Because red buff's in 16. Let's go over here to the red buff. Waiting for it. Waiting for it. Waiting for it. Don't worry, guys. I'll tell you a story to make this way less painful to wait for. Okay, so, nope. The story's over. We're going to grab red buff and then top lane ganks. Because Aatrox is so far ahead, right? That we got we to gotta put the herd on him. All right, let's go. Let's go. So, I'm going to make my way towards... Okay, I'm struggling with the pathing here, but I'm gonna make my way towards topside. Okay. Let's go over here. And we're gonna go up into here. All right, I'm coming. Whee! Okay, you know what? It was worth to give Aatrox a kill. Dude, this Malzahar is really annoying, huh? Also, a lot of people were asking about my opinion about the Master E nerf. So let me go ahead and fill you in while I'm dead. So first of all, if you haven't seen it already, this is what the Master E win rate looks like after the hotfix nerfs. His pick rate's also a little bit down, but, you know, that's to be expected, right? Now, does it mean he's unplayable? No, not really. We just got to adapt a little bit, right? Um, he will be playable again shortly, I'm sure of it. However... Um, you know, for now, you just got to learn to deal with it. I also heard that this patch is a long one too, but yeah, anyway, it's, it's fine. It's fine. So my opinion on the nerfs is that, man, he was gutted like a fish, but I love Master Yi. I'll never give him up. You know, I'll never give him up. He's basically when I dream, I dream of Master Yi. When I think of Master Yi, I think of myself. We are one. We are the same individual almost, almost. What's going on top lane? So, you know, my boy, he's gotten he's gotten wrecked. But me plus ye equal cow sep. Without ye, I'm just a cow. I th well, you know, I'm, I'm not sure if that's how that works, but uh anyway, so let's go ahead and clear this and go over to here. We got a set coming in hot here. And uh well, what's good is that set got some kills, so he's worth money again cuz you got to remember set was worth like 140 gold last time I killed him. So it's good to see him getting some kills and uh, helping us out here. Enemy team's got objective bounties, which is to be expected. We got two dragons on him and eight kills. Oh, they did get a shutdown. I mean, as long as they don't get Aatrox. Twitch is the one with the shutdown, which is fine. So if we look at the enemy team cup, who's going to be a problem later in the game? Set, Wukong, Malzahar with Zanyas, and maybe Brand with Zanyas. So it's basically going to come down to us focusing on Twitch. And this, again, is why we need Death Dance, because we have to be able to survive long enough to kill people with Zanyas or other things like that, right? Oh, mm. hey, and I want this blue buff. It's up. It tries to say, hell no. Uh, okay, I found Wukong. Oh, I found this blue buff. Somebody's on the other side of the wall. Let's go. We got to get out of here. Ooh, fruities. Gimme, 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 gimme. Mmm, yummy. Uh, I guess we could go for Malzahar here. Oh, no ward. Malzahar. Malzahar, you should have warded. Me and Aatrox are coming. Me and Aatrox are coming. Wee. Okay, can you please stop this set, Aatrox? Stop him. Stop. <laughs> oh, man. You, you're beefy. You're beefy. All right, I got to head back. We got to get that dragon because I want to keep this dragon control that we have going on. And honestly, I don't think they can contest it while, uh, while this set's busy feeding. All right, so I'm going to kind of grab tier one boots because everybody's always like, Cash up, why don't you buy boots? I don't want to buy boots. All right. Also, Wukong has no ulti, though I have no smite. But I still think the dragon is heavily in our favor here. So I'm going to go for this. Also, Twitch is dead, right? And set just respawning, so I should be able to get a good chunk of that dragon before set shows up. However, it is an earth dragon, which is naturally more tanky. Also, I'm not sure if it's still a thing, but it used to be. Oh. Oh, I was mid auto, bro. Oh, no. 
Okay, I was wrong, guys. I was wrong. Okay, Zerath, you're really you're bothering me with these with these attacks, bro. All right, that is the dragon there. Okay, I was a little bit concerned that we might actually lose that dragon there. Um, honestly, I almost got Wukong. I kind of messed up a little bit, though. I don't know. It, it was rough. It was rough. But I think what we should do now is we should go for Rift Herald so we can continue to deny them the objective bounties here. And we'll get the um, Death Dance. And, wow, Aatrox already has his Death Dance. I'm telling you guys, this item is just, like, busted. If you're not building this item on Master, you're doing it wrong. Don't go, like, full glass cannon. Get a Death Dance. It is just unbelievably broken. Just think about all the players you play against that have death stance and how frustrating they are to kill. And now imagine as a Yi player how frustrating you are to kill. Uh, oh, get some of that set gold, baby. Some of that set gold. Also, Wukong has the ult up now. I gotta be careful with that. Okay, legendary. I'm gonna pop into here. Brand is their support, right? Now he's starting to hang out in mid. Because now Malzahar is in bot. Also, did you guys know Alpha Strike can hit the Eye of the Herald? Look at that. Pretty nice, huh? You can literally just stand in one place, and whenever it turns, you Alpha. What? Boom, 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 boom. Easy. Way easier. Way easier than it was before, let me tell you. But, you know, that's all. Ooh, he left me a crab. Now, this is a true friendship. How, how far are we from the Dust Blade, or the Dust Dance? So, for the Dust Dance... We want to get. Um, damn, what? The, I just completely lost my train of thought there, I guess. So, oh my god, I'm missing all the CS too. So, we need to get another 150 gold to get this death stance. So, I could clear boss side. Actually, it's 100 gold now. We can clear boss side and go back for the death stance. You don't want to fight. At this point, you don't want to fight until you have death stance. Because it's just such a big advantage. Wow, Twitch is level 10 now. Team is throwing, boys. They are throwing. I guess the Malzahar is a better support than Brand, huh? Oh, come on, man. You're going to do me like this? All right, bro. Come on, come on, Red. Yes. I'm going to act shocked. <laughs> I'm going to act shocked and confused. I can't believe that just happened. I can't believe that just happened. No way. Oh, Vayne's going to a different lane. I'll take that. All right. Let's grab this. Man, I got me a entire Rift Herald I want to throw into this, guys. All right. I need a back immediately. Grab Death Stance. And now, guys, what's up next? So this is where we need to start looking at what the enemy team comp looks like before we fully decide what to build. A lot of pretty squishy people, but we also have two bruiser people, right? So we could get Kraken if the Bruisers are a problem, but neither of them are really a problem. The Squishies are the problem, right? So we're actually going to be running a Dust Blade because we want to have a more team fight oriented build here. And I think Dust Blade will do a way better job at doing that. So I'm going to split into this guy and we're going to use this Eye of the Herald. I'm pretty sure we win these splits. Oh yeah, not only do we win these splits, we single handedly win these splits. Yeah, I don't have uh, ulti anymore, but... Okay, and you can see how easy it is to just win these fights when you have this build. Oh my god, how do I do a CS, please? Though we want to get down to a situation where uh, we want to get into team fights because actually Destiny has a great team fight. We actually got 427 healing on that one. I feel like I just saw something move, guys. What was that? What was that? All right, let's kill this. All right, so I don't have ulti for another 25 seconds. We got to be careful with what we're doing. Got to be careful. I'm going to take this camp. I got 20 seconds. That's all I got to do. Shelly, you're going in without me. It pains me. It pains me to know. Oh, man, I want to int so bad, but it's right before the fourth dragon. And if we secure this dragon, we can secure the game, right? But if I don't secure the dragon, I can also make the game more interesting because, you know... It won't be, we won't be killing them as hard. Set, can you come up through here by chance? Here, I'll just go down and kill him again. Oh, wow. Whee! He used everything on the mini wave. 
<laughs> yeah. He did, dude, I mean, come on. Who expects a mashy to be sitting in the bush here? Right? I wouldn't have expected it. You know what, Set? You do you, man. There's no problem with that, man. You just wanted to see us a little bit faster. I understand, man. I would have done the same thing. I would have alpha eat that wave. Kind of like I just did, right? Um, anyway, so now we got to go secure the objective. Because if we don't secure it, right, they get an objective bounty and we also lose out on the soul. So, uh, it's, you know, it's still losable. Aatrox just gave up 1k to Malzahar. So I should probably look at getting a Quicksilver, actually. Quicksilver would be a pretty reasonable build here. But I think, um, uh, I think I want to get Dustblade first. Well, no, actually, it just depends. If we're going to be team fighting a lot early, then I think Quicksilver is the way to go. If we're going to be team fighting a lot early, then we probably want to go Dustblade. Okay, yeah, you know what? I don't know which one I want. I guess we should probably get Quicksilver just to be safe, though. But I'm so close to Duskblade. But if Malzahar ults me, then the fight's basically over for me anyway. But I'm so close to Duskblade. Yes, but... <sighs> There's conflict in my heart, guys. There's conflict in my heart. Hey, 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 Trice. What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't worry, team. I'll be there in a second. Wow, I'm almost level 15 at 22 minutes in. How's my CS looking? Oh, man, I've been CS in a storm. Guys, look at this. I got 200 CS at 22 minutes as a jungle. Pog? I don't even know how I did that. I got six kills, too. I mean, that's just what happens, you know? Oh, we got enough for Dust Dance, or Dust Blade. <laughs> Guys? Guys, remain calm. Dust Blade is in my possession. Let's go. Now, a lot of you guys may be like, well, didn't the Mass GE nerf Dust Blade? And yeah, it did. It did, right? The nerfs made it so that our cooldown is 0.69 seconds now with the Dust Blade, right? But, you know, 0.69 is pretty good. It's pretty nice. But anyway, in regards to that, I don't think it's actually that much of a nerf. I think that the invisibility with Dust Blade just makes it the most viable option when you're trying to climb ELO. Because Mass GE just doesn't have the survivability in these fights, right? And the invisibility really gives that to you. Uh, let's, uh, hope that Wukong doesn't take this, huh? Alright, people are dying. Fortunately, Aatrox is keeping them out. Alright, that was pretty good. And we can see the Death Dance healing for a thousand, two thousand. We just healed over a thousand health in that fight from Death Dance, right? The item's insane. It's actually insane. So let's go ahead and continue to clear this. And yeah, so this this game's obviously a little bit different than some of the ones I've been uploading recently. So this one is more about my optimal build instead of trying a bunch of different builds and stuff like that, right? And in my opinion right here, this, this is core. After this, it's pretty much up to you what you want to buy. But, I mean, I guess I will give my opinion as I go into it. So at this point, you know, I'm going to get a quick silver because of Malzahar, right? We cannot allow Malzahar to ult us because if he ults us, right, the fight's over. Um, they have a lot of magic damage as well. I think Witten would be a really solid choice here as a uh, an item afterwards. Let's say that, you know, if you didn't have to get Quicksilver, uh, go for the Witten next. Man, I'm just so tempted to skip that Quicksilver, guys. You cannot understand. But I already know the pain that's going to happen when Malzahar ults me. At some point in this game, it will happen. Like, look at him. He's already sitting there. He's already chilling. Hey, the shield blocks the Death Dance from stopping my back. It's a miracle, guys. It's a miracle. So let's grab this. Start working towards that Death Dance. Put this on my slot three. Yeah, I think Wit's End would be the nicest next item. Well, Twitch is really close. The nicest next item. Man, look at those soul. Mm hmm. All right. And then after Wit's End, I would probably look at... Uh, well, let's continue to look at their team comp, right? Agunju's Rage Blade is great if the Bruisers were becoming a problem, right? Because you need to be able to kill them. But the Bruisers aren't like a huge issue, so I don't really need Agunju's Rage Blade. Um, owie, dude, I wanna, I wanna dive him. Ow! Um, Aatrox, I might have just threw. Wait, why didn't it use my Quicksilver? I Quicksilver his ult, and I was like, why isn't it working? I think it's because Wukong knocked me out. Okay, but anyway, as I said, guys, I need to make the game a little bit more interesting, guys, or else, you know, it's just going to be kind of stompy, right? That was my plan all along. 
What? Okay, dude, that Vayne didn't even mess around with that Twitch. He just, like, triple tapped him. Triple tapped him. All right, guys. Also, we're going to buy an Elixir of Iron here as we try to conclude the game. And we also have the Dragon, right? So the Dragon's coming up, and we need to be as strong as possible for this Dragon. Um, and the Elixir of Iron is really interesting because it gives you more health, but it also gives you more size and tenacity, right? And you may be thinking, you know, as a Yi player, you don't really want this extra size. You don't want this bigger hitbox. But the thing is, is about this hitbox is it also makes it your auto range is larger as well, right? I think. <laughs> Somebody can correct me if I'm wrong. But I'm pretty sure your auto range is also larger when you have a bigger hitbox like this. So size actually isn't a terrible thing. It's not a terrible thing. Um, uh, well, everybody's kind of dying right before Dragon. I'm invisible. No, I'm not. I'm invisible. No, I'm not. Come on, I'm not going to throw, guys. I promise. I promise. Don't worry about it. This isn't a throw. I promise. Okay, almost. I... You, why didn't you heal me more, Death Dance? Why didn't you heal me more? It was it was close. It was close. Okay. I mean, you know, technically the dragon is up, but Malzahar is dead too. Okay. This wasn't this wasn't just a throw. Malzahar also also died. Um, I really want that wits though. You could also go ahead and upgrade this as well, but I think wits is just wits is just hands down the better choice here. And we're also gonna have enough to buy a pair of tier two boots because you guys are excited for those tier two boots, certainly. Um. Now, it could be a throw if Wukong respawned, ran to Dragon, 5-man or 4-man ulted my team, and then stole Dragon with Smite. Now, that could be a throw, and that would possibly be my fault. It could. But that won't happen. That won't happen. That won't happen. Fane, are you doing the dragon? That won't happen. That won't happen. Oh, God. Thank you. Thank you. Don't worry, team. I have dragon. I'm invisible. Mmm, I needed him to feel the BM. I needed him to feel it. I needed it. All right, let's go ahead and roll up to this here. And we're going to push it nicely. See, guys, I never throw. Nobody else has an Elder Dragon, but I do. And I know what you're thinking. Calcep, what's your plan now? My plan now is not to throw. I would never throw. Never, ever. Promise. I kind of want to sell my boots for a Witsen, though. Does that make me a bad person? I know. I know. Like, people seem to think that these boots are, like, super important and stuff. And you know what? They are kind of important. But Witsen is more important to me. Yo, is that Gromp up? Ooh, sick. But my team probably doesn't want me to back right now because we got to go kill Baron, right? Man, this enemy team is actually putting up quite a bit of a fight. Like, they are actually, they are fighting. They're fighting for everything. Because if Twitch shows up, actually, Twitch plus Wukong out. Wait, how did I not get the dragon kill? It was my kill. No, come back. Come back, Brand. Pa. Man, that, that's satisfying dragon, though. Run, chase him down. Chase him down, guys. Chase him down. Oh, dude, how are they keep stealing from the Elder Dragon? I don't understand. Anyway, guys, that's game. If you guys want to see some other cool videos, check out this one. This one's a pretty good video. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing my optimal build and actual gameplay. And goodbye. I love you all.